months ago, we announced a project working with Map Impact, the UK Space Agency, using satellite imagery to study the health of Windermere. And now we have the results. This is what we know. When people are here in Windermere, their sewage goes into the lake. We also know that the vast majority of this sewage comes from the £7 billion water company, United Utilities. The more sewage there is, the more food there is for harmful algae. The first thing our study has shown is that when there are more people here, then there is more algae in Windermere. The second thing this study has shown is that these algal blooms are made even worse when the lake gets warmer. It's really that simple. What we have shown is that there is a direct correlation between the amount of people here and algae in the lake, and it gets worse when it's hotter and drier. In the last three years, there were single days around Windermere when there were over 300,000 people here. It just seems that the infrastructure cannot cope, and United Utilities, who owns the majority of the local infrastructure, refused to provide us any data for this study. This is not about the amount of people that come here. This is about inadequate investment. It's about insufficient regulation, which has not protected our lake. And the solution is very, very simple. Stop the sewage to save Windermere.